Hey and welcome, so this is DCS World, Digital Combat Simulator. I was thinking about putting this next comment at the end of one of my videos, but I won't do that because I really want to bring it to your attention. Say you've got the Toby R Tracker 5, and you're looking around, and you just want to disable it for a few seconds. So, you can do right control and left on the keyboard, as I've got set up in my Toby settings. So, if I go into my game hub, and you go down to the very bottom, well, if you go into the game hub, and we go down to the very bottom, you'll see in my case I've got um, enable disable key and I've got it set to right control plus left. You can set it to something else if you want. So that right control and left, when you go and tap it, now you want to use the mouse to look around. So you use left alt and C to look around and it won't do anything. You know, like it's just, it's not functional. So if I go and turn it back on, the other option to try and just get to use your mouse for a little while without having to disable your Toby is just hit escape, go into adjust controls. You see up here it says head tracker. So you click down this little arrow and it says disabled. Click that once. Click OK. And it's solved. Because now you can just hold down left alt and C and look around with your mouse. So say there's a certain part of your flight where you want the Toby R tracker and some other part where you don't, you're going to do air to air refueling. And then another part of your flight, you want to just look down here at your radar or something for a while or whatever. So you're happy to use the mouse for a little while. You can do that fairly quickly um, by just jumping in and out of air. So you hit an escape, just controls up here at the head tracker button and just remove the disable button. Now we're back to head tracker. So now we can, you know, do our air to refueling or whatever it is. We can take our autopilot off and we can start to fly the plane with the head tracker. If we're finished with that, we could hit escape, adjust controls, head tracker, disabled, OK. And now you've got your mouse to look around. And you can just, you know, say you want to move between the two, you can do that. I just want to make that point because no one explained that to me. and um. It took me a really long time to work out some kind of solution to that. So, yeah, the, the other solution, if you don't know what you're doing, is you'd go into here, and you go into Access, and instead of hitting Disabled, you'd go and remove all of these settings. So you'd click that, click Clear, click that, click Clear. But then you ha you've got, when you want to go back to using your Toby, you've got all this removed. And so you've got to go through trying to re-enable all of that for all of these different settings. Um, it's just so much easier to click this little arrow, click Disabled, and then click OK. You know, um, I just think that's really, really helpful to know. And it just makes this Toby R Tracker 5 so much more helpful. Especially when you're learning planes and um, there's different times when you, you want to use the Toby R Tracker 5 and other times when you don't. And just simply using um, this on the Game Hub software with the right control and left to enable disable. It will enable or disable, but it won't let you get back to mouse control. So I disable it, that's cool. I can look in this area for a while, but if I do left alt and C, I can't look around with my mouse in this game. Yeah, it's just locked. And there's no, <laughs> there's nothing I can do here. So you're gonna get really frustrated and it's gonna go, oh no, this is no cool. So yeah, um, right control and left. And, and then for the few times you need to, just go and hit an escape, go into adjust controls, and you've got your head tracker up here, and click that, disabled. It's a toggle button, on and off, yeah? So, if we come up with a better solution, just my comment to all of you, if you know of a way I can hit disabled and enabled by just using a hot key on the keyboard, please let me know, because at the moment, there's not like I can set a key to this somewhere. Um, so that's what would be good if we had to. I don't know if they're going to provide that functionality and if there is a way for me to do that I don't know how I've got it every single time hit escape adjust controls click disabled okay do you know what I mean I've got to go through those four steps I can't just tap one button on the keyboard to toggle on toggle off the head tracker and that whole toggle on toggle off button is basically this yeah, the enable disable button, but that's, as I said, not going to work for you if you're trying to get back to and do an Alt C to look around. So I tap it, cool, it's disabled, but I can't do Alt C now to look around with my mouse. The only way I can do that is to go in here and disable. So yeah, that's with the game. 
um, interesting little thing I just wanted to bring up. I've made a separate video about it, but if people who do watch it, well, they'll pick up on it. That's all. That that was the mission. That was the mission in this video. That was the that was the all the content. Cool. Hope you enjoyed. I really do hope you have a great day. See ya.